Hi everybody, this is Robert Rivera with uh, Rivera Trading Group and in association with uh, Trend Trading Academy. I'm here at the doctor's office while my beautiful wife is getting therapy on her messed up ankle. She's been, um, uh, had, she had surgery recently and I'm just sitting here trying to figure out how to make the best use of my time. And I was thinking about um, why would people invest in Forex? You, you know, that's my mantra nowadays, right? Uh, <laughs> if you don't know, you'll be learning it soon. Uh, just because uh, you're going to find out here in just a minute. Uh, why, for example, why Forex instead of uh, instead of uh, a stocks? Well, if you don't know, if you want to day trade, I mean, you can you can buy and hold stocks and get a return on investment that can be significant. If you find the right stock at the right price, you can hold it and make money long term. Uh, that's one way of doing it, and a lot of people have become rich doing that. But for those who would want to compound their money now day trading is where it's at right the challenge with day trading is that you have to be in tune to what's going on in the market especially stock market to have a good idea of whether it's going up or whether it's going down um what is the price fluctuation for the day a bunch of uh different information that you have to find in order to get confluence on whether again you're going to be buying or selling um, and uh, and also on top of that, you have to have at least twenty five thousand dollars in order to avoid violating the day trading rule. Now you can uh, trade, I believe it's two times a day. Oh no, no, two times a week, or is it two times every five days, or is it two times every seven days? I don't know. They made it so hard. Basically, you can't put your money in and out of the market. You can go in and leave it in, um, but you can't go in and go out and go in and go out in, the, in a week. Um, so think about it. You have to put in the market $25,000 minimum and then that money has to sit there. Uh, you can't really uh, use it for your to make a profit today. In Forex, you can start with as, as little as $50. You can start with 50 bucks. My bro, my uh, mentor started with $36 and then took his lunch money and added it until he had $1,000 in his account. And that's where he started from. Because obviously with $1,000, you can make a lot more money than with 36, right? Um, but my point being is that you can start anywhere. Heck, you can start with a demo account, with a fake account, fake money account, which you can also do on stocks, but again, you could be doing that on stocks, waiting to save your money to make at least $25,000. And really, you need about 50 grand. Uh, really, in stocks, you need about 50 grand if, you, if you're going to be doing day trading because you are going to have fluctuations in your win and losses until you figure it out. And Forex, who can't start with $100? And if you burn $100 because you don't know what you're doing, can't you put another $100 in? Of course you can. So, um, why Forex over stocks for that very reason. The convenience that you can store with very little money and yet you can gain quite a bit. I mean, there's a lot of more leverage. Not uh, That's a whole different topic, by the way, talking about leverage, uh, how to use prop the proper use of leverage. Um, margin is another name of it for it, especially in stocks. But in, in, uh, in Forex, uh, leverage is the most used. It's basically where your broker lends you money for you to trade with. If you're using proper risk management, uh, leverage is not going to hurt you. So again, there's a myth related to that. If you're using proper risk management, you're not going to get hurt by that. But here's the bottom line. You can have $100 and use your uh, your broker's leverage of 300 500 to 1 And with $100, if you have the skill set, you can turn that $100 into $5,000, into $10,000, and it's unlimited from there. So another reason why I love Forex is because it takes very little money to get started. Of course, you won't make a lot of money with that little money, but you can make that money grow. Heck, in stocks, my, uh, my mentor in stocks started with, I believe it was $580, and he turned that into a million dollars in a year and a half. Had he been doing Forex, I, I can't even imagine what he could have done with the leverage that he can get in Forex versus the leverage that you get um, when you're trading stocks. Anyway, this is already a long video. I want to keep it short. So 
Anyway, this is Robert Rivera with uh, Rivera Trading Group and Trend Trading Academy. And if you are considering investing or trying to make money from home, your computer or your phone, doing stocks or Forex, my recommendation is Forex. It takes a whole lot less risk to get it done, to learn it, and to, uh, and to get started. That's it.